A code law system is a legal system where the general principles of the law are found exclusively in one or more legal codes and where judges are supposed to apply these codes mechanically to reach legally correct decisions. By a legal code, I mean a document which sets out the law in a particular area. For example, this picture shows the French Civil Code. It sets out the general principles of the law relating to people, to property and securities or financial instruments. You can find the Civil Code online or you can walk into a bookshop and buy it. The Civil Code is one of the most important legal codes in France. The other important legal code is the Penal Code, which sets out all the crimes you can be charged with. There are just under 80 legal codes in France, shown here on our government website, but many of these other codes deal with far more specialised areas of law, like maritime law or military law. When they decide cases, judges are supposed simply to apply these codes. They are not supposed to be creative when they do this. This means that there is no role in code law systems for judge-made law or precedent. Of course, sometimes the provisions of the relevant code are ambiguous or don't apply well to a new set of facts. In these cases, appeal courts may have to reach a decision which couldn't be predicted just by reading the relevant code. But these decisions are treated as though they explained what the code meant all along and as an act of interpretation rather than an act of creation. Code law systems are sometimes referred to as civil law systems. For example, Matthias Seem's textbook on comparative law discusses common law and civil law. I prefer to talk about code law systems because civil law on its own can stand for non-criminal law and because by referring to code law systems, by emphasising the code, I make it clearer what is distinct about these systems.